Hello, everybody. It's Mary Kay with MKK's Artful Journey. Just getting it all set up here. So we have a challenge, and the challenge is um, for May 22nd, Mindless Quarantine Art Challenge um, by um, Erin Morrison. And she has given us permission to use the challenge and um, fly with it, you know. And so my group, which is MKK's Artful Journey and Scrappin' Unicorn Lizzie. I think that's it. Scrappin' Lizzie Unicorn. Something like that. Hers. I know. I only never get it right. Um, Scrappin' Lizzie Unicorn is her, her thing. So anyway, so on this one, the directions are to glue, sew, sew or glue, sew, or a combination of both scrap fabric or paper pieces to create a garden scene of your own design. You can take one big piece of fabric or paper large enough for a journal spread. In your mindless quarantine art challenge journal, you can use buttons, gems, sequins, googly eyes, or anything else that you'd like to embellish it. Be blessed, safe, creative, inspired, and mostly have a mindful, mindless fun. Have a blessed day. Okay, so that's our challenge. It's a garden, and, and they didn't say flowers or whatever. But I don't know. I don't know. Well, I kind of prepared a little bit. So this is a piece of canvas paper, which is really nice because I get it. Um, you can get it at the art store. It comes in a pad just like, you know, this. So this is Strathmore and, and it's just it's canvas paper. So you could actually paint on it with um, acrylic paints and um and it works out really good. So my heaters come on and it feels good because <laughs> I am so cold. Oh, I just hope it's not covered. Oh no, it's covered with something. Well, it still feels good. I'll 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 deal with it. It's it's kind of coming out towards me. Oh, brr. I've been cold since last night. So. I got, I was with a group and I got this Happy Mail, which is um, another, it's, um, oh, what do you call it? Oh, Jess. <laughs> burlap, burlap, that's what it's called. So it's like colored burlap. And I have all different colors here. So I'm going to use that. And I've already pre-cut my burlap. And let's see here. So it would go like this. And, and I would just glue it here. Hold on. My cat is being crazy. He's been yesterday he slept all day. And today he wants attention. <laughs> See, even my glue is cold. Oh, my goodness. So, here we go. I'm just going to put the glue around there. Like so. I'm just going to lay it on its side. And then we're just going to glue it right on here. Like this. It goes through. <laughs> we'll put the other one on. And I could sew this on, but, you know, my sewing machine is... Um, not in a good place to where I can use it. It's over on my table over there, but there's no, like, electricity 
connection and then my camera's too low on this side to to do it under the camera so let's see here Do, 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 do. There we go. All right, so there's that part. And then I thought that blue was really pretty for clouds. And you know how clouds sometimes look like something? That kind of looks like a turtle. So I was going to use that cloud. And then this cloud. And then I have these little um, leftover strips. Um, and actually this one is going to go closer this way. And so I'm just going to put my, I'm going to put this one here. Oop. All right. I'm going to put that one there. And this one here. Well, I got it. My, um, this is the flower I'm going to use. I made these earlier, so that's going to be okay. So it won't, won't, um, be crushed too much. And then this one on the edge. I got to watch this one because these are big. These are huge. So, so this one's going in the center. And I'm just going to put this glue right on there. And we'll just stick this right on there like that. And these are just, you know, these were like, each one was a separate flower. And then I just put a, um, a brad in the middle. And this is like a jewel brad that I had. And I had a whole bunch of these flowers. You know you can get them at Michael's. They're just like amazing how many you can get I'm gonna put the glue over here since it's running pretty good close it up so these are my other two flowers so I think I'm gonna stick this one here it's kind of off the edge a little bit I don't know I wonder oh I was just wondering do you think I can lift that one up again <laughs> Oh, isn't that funny? So I gotta push that over a little bit. And then this one, I'm just gonna glue it this way so that it it'll overlap just a little bit, but not too much. There we go. Those will be there, and then I'll just wipe this up because. And we'll just wipe it on here. And then open this back up because I gotta put glue on this. I know it seems like I cheated, huh? So one oh come on. One cloud, two clouds. There we go. Oop. Oopy doop boop. No, oh, I want that cloud to be straighter. Maybe I want it this way. There. There. There's my little um, garden scape. Should have a little bench right here, but nah, I don't have a any. I don't have a way to make a bench. <laughs> so there's my art. I should sign it though, because you know we should always sign our art. So I'm gonna sign mine. M K L M and then five twenty two five twenty two. There's my art, 
and this is going to go into a journal so I folded the page and we're going to set that over here to dry so the other thing so that was my challenge so I'm done with that the other thing I'm going to show you is the Dollar Tree has been open through this whole whole thing and I haven't been there I mean I've been there but only to get the essentials well I went there today just because I thought I deserved it and I got my favorite candies <laughs> these are my favorite candies and I got my husband he likes Mike and Ike and then I got these I haven't tried these before but I like these because they're real soft and then I found this. I thought this was really cool. And I thought, because I have a whole bunch of stuff, you know, like papers and stuff like that, I thought I would just go through them and bag them up. Get them ready to go out because I need to. I need more room. So anyways, I just want to look at these real quick. Ugh. Oh, look, there's a thing right there. <laughs> so these are storage bags, and there's three each. And they are, they have handles on them. And it looks like they are gallon bags. So that looks like it'll fit a 12 by 12 paper. So let's see here. Yep, that's 16 by 15, 15 by 16. So those are really nice and they have handles on them. So that's really cool. So I got those and then I can put some papers in them and maybe even sell the papers on a marketplace or something. So. That's what I was thinking. So I got two of those. And I could make a little kit with it. That's kind of cool. All right. So then I got parchment paper. And I bought this bag. It's a nice little um, beach bag. And I got, my nephew is home with his mom, and he's only, I think he's five, but, you know, I was thinking, I was trying to think what, because they're getting bored, <laughs> I was trying to think, oh, this would be kind of cool for them, but then I'm thinking I should go back and get one for myself, because that's National Geographic's. Oh, and then I found these cool things. And there's a pocket up front, you know, so you can put stuff there. But then there's this big pocket in the back, so you can put stuff there. So I got two of those. And I stopped by my friend's house, and she gave me my bag of glitter back. And then I found this. Remember how... Everybody's like so into using these things for their, for, you know, for, you know, and they're so expensive, but I got this. It's huge. I found a huge one. They had smaller ones. I got a smaller one before, but I was like, ooh, ooh, I'm grabbing it. I'm grabbing it. It's a buck. So look, and there's a tag. So I'll put that in the tag box. Throw this away. All right. And then I got these facial wipes because I got these before and they work really good after I'm at the food bank. And I just wipe my face down afterwards and it's all clean. So those are my some of my finds. I got one more find that I got at, um, or a few more at the Dollar Tree. I got another bag. I was thinking about my niece, mm, my niece, my granddaughter. So I got this one. It says feathers are fabulous, and it's a pink flamingo. 
and it has a snap on it too so really nice for the beach and then oh i stopped at my friend's house the one that gave me the glitter and she gave me the new stampin up catalog oh and i got another um three bags of the, the large bags and i got these because i like these they're really cool for the glue. And so I got three more and they got pretty lids. So that's kind of cool. And then, oh, I got myself some junior mints. And then I saw this gum and I thought, what? Kool-Aid gum? And I don't even chew gum, but I thought maybe for my niece. My niece, my granddaughter. <laughs> so I'm going to put those back, these back in there. And then I, and Tuesday mornings was open. Isn't that exciting? So Tuesday mornings was open. And I got this bag. Because, you know, you can't bring your bags anymore. It was only 99 cents for that bag. It's a nice big bag. So I got the essentials, right? had to get some thin mints they're orange thin mints and I like the taste of those I've already got them open I got this and it has one two and three and I thought that was really cool so I got that and then I got some more essentials orange cream and they were a dollar twenty nine, fifty percent off. So who could, who could go wrong with that? I love orange and chocolate. And then I found this, which is a dollar ninety nine. But I like the stickers, you know, because it has a copy sticker, and it's holographic and gold. Oh, let's just open it up and see what it is. Okay, so these are stickers. Oh, I, I just thought that was so cool looking. Today is the best ever wonder. And look, there's a unicorn. May all your dreams come true. Oh, there's more in here than I thought. And then there's more coffee cups. And there's a little unicorn there again. This crap in Lizzie's like, oh, and it's like washi tape. This is like washi tape. And there. And then some letters. Oops, and I just dropped whatever else I had on the floor. And then, oh, look, a little file folder. A little place to store them. Well, I guess I gotta tone them down a little bit. Put one on one side. One on the other, so they close. Neato! And then a tag! So, and then, let me reach this other thing down here. <laughs> Darn it, I can't, I can't reach it! <laughs> so I was looking around at their napkins, and they had some on sale. And I saw them, and I thought, oh, those are cool! And I thought they were like $4.99. And I thought, oh my goodness, that's a lot. And then I walked it down one thing and I saw these for $2.69. And I thought, I'm getting those. And then I found some more for $2.29. So look, there's a bird on there. And they're real pretty black. And this one has a bird. Birds and butterflies. And then... I got these. I love stars. I love paper clips. I like to collect those kind. And then I got these. Isn't that cool? They're library cards. And they were a buck ninety-nine. I'm so excited. I like my finds. I spent how much did I spend? Oh, I had the receipt here a minute ago. I guess I got it all for free. <laughs> I spent $14, I think. Oh, here it is. I can't reach it. 
There we go. I spent, oh, my bad. I spent $16 in the Tuesday morning. And at the Dollar Tree, Dollar Tree, I spent on my essentials. <laughs> I spent thirty dollars. <laughs> I spent less at Tuesday morning, so that's a good thing, right? <laughs> Anyways, everybody, thank you for joining me, and I appreciate you. Um, let me read from the my book of prayers and let's see here let's do moving into the future because right now we are moving into the future with this um we're going to go to like phase two i think because we've already done phase one where we opened up some of the stores so um lord i surrender my past present and future to you now Help me not to be anxious about my future, but to rest in the knowledge that my future is secure in you. I want to keep one foot in eternity by never letting go of your hand. I want to store up so many treasures in heaven that heaven will feel familiar the moment I arrive. And when I do take that final step into my eternal fu eternal future with you, I trust that you will be there for me with all the light I need for that step too. There is surely a future hope for you, and your hope will not be cut off. Proverbs 23, um, verse 18. And that's from the NIV um, Bible. Amen. So that was a good good message for us. And um, just to know that God's going to be there for us no matter what we're up to. If, we're here, if we stay here or if we go go away, you know, go to heaven. So, and this is, oh, this is my other thing I bought, my vitamin B drink. Okay, I got paid today. <laughs> But I didn't know I got paid until after I bought all this stuff. Isn't that crazy? Well, everybody have a blessed day and a blessed weekend. And, oh, yeah, happy Memorial Day weekend. I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> Bye.